Hi everyone, my name is Amanda Hicks. I've spent the last eight years working at Lee Middle School in Wyoming as a sixth grade math teacher. I've learned a lot, experienced a lot, and have a lot to talk about with all of you. So why do I want to come teach at East Grand Rapids Middle School? The first reason is I just love being a middle school teacher. I can imagine being placed anywhere else. Middle schoolers are so goofy, they're willing to try new things, and it's amazing how much a middle schooler can grow over just one school year. I also just love math. You could say I'm kind of nerdy, and that's okay. I feel like my excitement about the content of math rubs off on my students and helps get them excited too. East Grand Rapids seems like a wonderful place where I could really grow professionally, and I love hanging out at Reed's Lake, so that would be a bonus to be closer. The influence I hope to have on students is not only them as mathematicians, but also them as people. I want my students to leave my class thinking math is fun. I think the best days are when they leave so excited about what we did that day and not even realizing how much math they actually got accomplished. One life skill I really try and instill in my students is perseverance. So I really try and challenge them, push them to try new things. It's okay to fail in my class, then we just try something else. And I think my students are okay with that because eventually we do succeed. Sometimes it just takes us a while. So now let me convince you that I'm the best candidate for this job. One thing that I've really focused on my last few years of teaching is Kagan Cooperative Learning. I actually, a few years ago, skipped what should have been the week of my honeymoon to attend a Kagan Cooperative Learning training because I was so excited to start implementing it in my classroom. I feel like Kagan allows me to take what would normally seem to kids as a boring textbook lesson and really make it come alive using the different structures. I've even created my own Kagan cooperative learning structures over the years, and my students love it, I love it, and they are very successful using it. I also have attended the Kagan Level 2 training on multiple intelligences. Kind of a funny story, I actually won a scholarship to go to Florida for that training, and that's also something I implement regularly in my classroom. Another thing that I've really been working on is my interactive notebook for my classroom. So the kids really take a lot of ownership in it and it has really helped them retain the information that we learn in class. It also is a tool I use to help them monitor their progress. So they have charts with assessment scores, IXL scores, and everything so they know exactly where they're at and what they should be working on. My colleague and I are actually working on a project right now, creating interactive notebook pages that are just folding, so no cutting required, because we're really trying to optimize student learning time, but still have the resource of the interactive notebook. As I was snooping on some of your websites, I noticed that you guys also use the website IXL, and I feel like with my middle school math department, we've come up with some great resources that supplement that and help students be successful on IXL. We've come up with charts where students can record progress and work ahead or we can remediate and that's been amazing. We've also come up with different work papers students could use so I'd love to share those ideas with you guys in person. Professionally, I do have my master's in curriculum, which has really helped get my middle school team aligned to the Common Core. I love presenting at conferences, which you probably saw on my resume. I just think it's great to share my knowledge. I love meeting new people and also learning from them. Those are the best resources to have. So I hope I've convinced you that I'm the best candidate. I'm about out of time, and I want to wish you a great summer, and I would love to continue my educational journey at East Grand Rapids Middle School. Thank you.